here with a 2017 17-bay BMW 435D X-Drive M Sport Grand Coupe. Now we do have the LED headlights as well as the black kidney girls. Full M Sport styling, which includes black front splitter, side skirt extensions and also rear diffuser. Now the colour of this car is called Snapper Rocks and really does stand out from the rest and is a superb colour. Now we do have four superb 19 inch alloy wheels finished in gloss black with the M Sport brake calipers just high and behind. Now we do have the sunroof just up there as you can see as well as the privacy glass on the rear. Now we also do have black window trim and also the M Sport badging on the front wing. And we also have the Grand Coupe badging on the rear windows just there as well. Now we do have front and rear parking sensors with rear reversing camera. Dual exhaust flush with rear bumper and rear diffuser. Now we also have a power assisted rear tailgate and a shark fin antenna. And there's a quick look at one of those superb alloy wheels. Now if we go to the rear of the car, I'll show you the interior. Now we do have coral leather throughout, which is Dakota. And we also have isofix points just down there as well, as well as a pull down lever arm with with two nice size cup holders. Now behind the driver and passenger seat you also have storage nets just there, as well as 12 volt connectivity and vents in the centre. Now under doors you do have your coral Dakota leather just there as well, with electric windows and integrated Harman Kardon speakers. Now if we go to the front of the car, there's a look at the driver's front seat. We also have the electric windows just there, as well as the integrated harm kind speakers. Now you also have your power, assist, uh, power folding mirrors. Jumping inside the car, you do have your auto lights just down there. Front on the brake, you do have a keyless start there as well. Now we do have the digital dash, and as you can see, it is free for many worn lights just there. Now this vehicle has done just over 39,300 miles, and again, it's free many worn lights on the dash. Now being a digital dash when you put it into different drive modes it does change colour and change look. So put it into Eco Pro it then turns to blue and also the dial on the right hand side changes as well. Now I've put it into sport and then changes to red which is a more aggressive colour. Now pop it back into comfort. Now I do have your multifunction steering wheel with cruise control with speed limiter just there, as well as your volume select just there, and your media mode just there, whether it's going through Apple CarPlay, Bluetooth audio, or the DAB radio. Now just behind me do have your auto wipers as well as paddle shift if we take the car into manual mode. Now going to the centre, we have this screen just here. Now if we go into media, we do have DAB radio. Scrolling down, we do have FM, AM, AM, music collection, CD, DVD. And we also have Apple CarPlay and Bluetooth media connectivity just there as well. Now pop it into reverse, you can see the front and rear parking sensors and the rear reversing camera just there as well. Now I do have satellite navigation just there, as well as nav. Bluetooth phone connectivity there as well. Then again you have your different drive modes where you have Eco Pro, Comfort, Sport and also Sports Plus. Now coming down here, we do have your dual zone climate control which works just as you would expect it to. Now we also have two heated front seats, so for those cold winter mornings, rear does make all the difference. Now we also have your ice cold aircon, for those hot summer days, rear does make all the difference. Coming down there, you do have a bit of a storage tray just here. Push this open, you do have two nice size cup holders. Here you can turn track control on and off, as well as your driver mode select, as well as your parking sensors on and off. Now you have your BMW individual trim that goes along there as well on the dashboard and the door handles. Now this is what you use to control everything happens on the screen. So well. you have your touchpad just on the top there where you can zoom in and out of the map just there as well. Soft touch lever armrests with storage in there as well. And there's a look at the passenger's full Dakota coral lever front seat. Now the armrest moves forward and back to also suit your driving position. You have extended fire support if you may need it there as well. Now this vehicle is available to take away today with free contactless nationwide next day delivery. So HBI Clear comes with fresh service, new MOT and we do have competitive life finance. Thank you very much for watching.
we do test drive of this BMW 435D X-Drive M Sport Grand Coupe. Now the purpose of this video test drive is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you would expect it to. As you can see, I'm not going to fight with the steering wheel to keep it a straight line. It's going straight and true, not veering off to the left or to the right hand side. Now do have a cruise control and speed limiter on the left hand side of the multifunction steering wheel. Now that's why I think the cruise control is if you push the button at the bottom and use the dial on the left hand side to push up or down and then it'll adjust to the nearest miles per hour. To go up by one, push up very slightly and to go up by five, push it up until you feel a bit of a flick in your finger and then that is adjusted to the nearest five miles an hour. Now we also have power shift if we set the car into manual mode as well. So we can take over now, so I'm currently in fifth, down to fourth, into third, back up to fourth, into fifth and then I'm going to let the car take back over by just simply letting go. Now I can also push the gear stick to the left as well to put it either into M or S. Now M meaning manual and S meaning sport. So you have your quicker gear changes when it is in sport. Now I do have very comfortable, comfortable full Dakota, uh, Dakota Coral Levers front seat, which you could easily do two, three, even four g miles and still get out feeling fresh. Now that they're also heated, they have an extended fire support. So for those cold winter mornings, pop the heated seats on and really just make all the difference. Now on the screen in front of me just there, we do have satellite navigation as well as DAB radio. Bluetooth media and Bluetooth audio connectivity and now we also have an optional rack shot of Apple CarPlay in this vehicle. Now added to, to the Apple CarPlay we do have the Harman Kardon integrated speakers which do sound absolutely incredible. As well we do have the sunroof just up there which you open from a button just there so push back and then it will close open, push back forward and then it will then close. But we also have the manual blind as well. Now we do have the BMW individual trim all around this vehicle on the dashboard and in the centre just here as well as the door handles which is a very nice addition to this vehicle. Now here at RS Cars Wheels we are a 5 star dealership. We are a 3 inch 5 star reviews on Google, Auto Trade and Cargoes. And if you read through the reviews our customers really do reiterate the fact how good we are to buy for and how caring of a company we actually are. Now we do offer free contact this nationwide next day delivery so wherever you are in the country we can facilitate that. Now if you're test driving this vehicle today you'd be listening out for anyone wanting knocks or bangs and if you're listening out during this test drive video there hasn't been any be sure it's a bonus when buying a used car. Now going over any bumps or potholes it really does take it very well and it really is a very comfortable car to drive especially those long distance drives. Now coming up to the industrial state we're going to take a right as you would if you're driving this vehicle today. I'm going to perform the major stop, put it straight into reverse, just show you the brakes work exactly how you expect it to, and you'll see it pop up in the centre of the rear reversing camera. So pulling in now, I'll be able to do the emergency stop in three, two, one. Fired onto the brakes, straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever, and you can see the rear camera just in the centre as well. It's a little car for the front and rear parking sensors. Now back into drive, no issues whatsoever. Now if you haven't answered all of your questions and inquiries, join this test drive and walk around the video. Please feel free to get in, get in contact with the sales team, where they can answer any answer questions and also run through some inquiries with you. But that's it for me in this video test drive. Hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.